All right, most of us spend a lot of time and money on skincare, right, for our face. But what about skincare for our body? And this week's Monday Morning Beauty Bag, Michelle Phillips is back to share her expert advice for a full body skincare plan. You are so right. I don't think people think about this enough. They no. just assume if they're using lotion, they're good. Yeah, and studies show that if we paid as much attention to our skin on our bodies mm -hmm. as we do our face, the skin on our bodies can look up to 10 years younger. Ooh, Who would want that, yeah. right? So I'm here to just share a few things very simple tips but the first one is when we take a shower or don't bath. Don't tell me this Michelle. Don't take such a hot shower or bath because it dries out your skin. I know my husband used to yell at uh -huh. me with a hot bath thing but it's really important that you just kind of turn that temperature okay. down if you're what does you it do dry, dry your skin out? It does it okay. dries out your skin. The other thing that dries out your skin is soap. Soap has enough detergents in it to scrub a floor. Oh. So you don't want that on your body. Lovely. So if you really want to use a soap, like a bar of soap, make okay. sure you use one that has like moisturizers in it. Okay. And also um, maybe think about using like a body wash okay. because body washes usually are infused with shea butter, vitamin E, yeah. different essential oils that can help moisturize your, moisturize your skin okay. while you're washing. And then the other thing is exfoliate in the shower a couple times a week. And you know, I was here a couple weeks ago. Uh -huh. We made a homemade body scrub made with cane sugar and olive oil and that uh, recipes on my website, but or you can use a nice exfoliant that you buy in the store. Now here, how do you pick a good one though? Because I feel like you can over exfoliate yes. too. You don't want something you yes. know, tearing up your skin. I like to buy exfoliants that have some kind of an oil base in them. So okay. that way when you're exfoliating, you're also moisturizing at the same time. And if you want, you know, just use that first and then use your body wash after. So that if there's any residual, okay. you know, granules, you get everything off. And then the next thing is, well, Real quick, how often do you exfoliate oh, too? At least twice a week. Okay, at least twice. Because that's what I feel like you hear people do it every day and it's no good. Yeah, you don't and it. especially before shaving, like on your okay. legs and such too. It'll give you a closer shave. Okay. And then the next thing I want to mention is that we moisturize our bodies when we get out of the shower, just when we kind of just tap, like pat your skin dry okay. so it's still kind of damp. And then I use oils. For myself, because I really I get very dry okay. skin, even though it's humid outside. It's not too greasy. No, you can go to the, the like the the health food store and pick up like jojoba oil or vitamin E. Okay. And if you, you know, use it all over your body, and then throw a robe on for a minute or two, and then if you want to add a body lotion on top of that or not. But if anything, at least use a good body lotion when you okay. get out of the shower. And then I also want to talk about protecting your hands. Okay because I think a lot of times we neglect our hands mm -hmm. and I feel it's really important to keep a good moisturizer for your hands mm -hmm. next to every sink. So when you're washing what your hands. What the signs of aging? I mean, you can yes. tell in your hands. Exactly, that's the exact point I was okay, gonna make, Carly. You're, you're so awesome. <laughs> because honestly, it's our face, uh -huh. our neck, our okay, decollete. I was say, neck, I feel like people And hands too. is the first place that we show our age. So we really wanna protect our hands and, and also um, at night before I go to bed, I use a nice hand cream okay. and I do apply body lotion again at night because at night is when our skin repairs itself. Yeah. And so that's where you really want to add another layer before you go to bed because then while you're sleeping, you're moisturizing your skin. All of this will pay off as, as you know, okay. time goes on because as you get older, mm -hmm. you're going to wish you took better care yeah. of your skin if you don't while you're young. Well, and so. some of the moisturizers, you can tell you put them on and like they didn't even do anything. No. You know? I mean, you need, what are some of the key, like do you like the oils? The I do. I really like, that's why I put the oil yeah. on, but um, shea butter, vitamin E. Okay. I mean, some of the, the you can look for um, different peptides and even okay. some of the skincare ingredients that we have mm -hmm. in our facial creams, you can find in body lotion. So pay attention to what you're buying mm -hmm. and look at the labels. Okay. Yeah. Michelle, thank you so much. Absolutely. Remember, think about your body as well, not yes. just your face. And exactly. uh, yeah, more tips on your website, right? That's right, michellephillips.com. All right. Thank you so much. We'll see you next Monday. Okay.